Well, New Orleans property owners, they're going to pay more in taxes this year thanks to the Orleans Parish School Board. Last night, board members voted to increase its millage to make up for cuts in state and federal funding. Paul Murphy reports one housing advocate says the tax hike will make an affordable housing crisis in the city even worse. New Orleans home and building owners will notice a jump in their property taxes when they receive their next city tax bill. The motion carries. The NOLA Public School Board voted unanimously to raise its rates by about $30 million. The school district claimed the hike was needed to offset a reduction in state funding and the loss of federal pandemic recovery money. This is an investment uh, overall, so it, it has a positive impact not just on the students and the teachers, but also on the community as a whole. The New Orleans City Council urged taxing agencies, including the school board, to cut rates this year. This after overall property assessments in the city jumped by about 18 percent. That's on top of steep increases in the price of insurance, housing and utility costs, and inflation. I stand firm, and as do other council members, that we want to do whatever possible to reduce costs to the people of the city of New Orleans, and that's what we'll continue to try to do. According to the school board, the average home valued at $250,000 would see about a $100 a year increase in property taxes. Greater New Orleans Housing Alliance President Andronicia Morris said even a modest tax increase would result in more student homelessness and displacement. She noted landlords would likely raise rents to pay the higher taxes. Their issue is, and we understand, that they have shortfalls because of enrollment issues. We know that those enrollment issues are rooted in this affordable housing crisis. So making it worse doesn't solve your problem. The tax dollars will be used to fund schools directly, with much of it going to instructional activities. Paul Murphy, WWL, Louisiana. Property tax bills typically go out in December, but they were delayed while the school board decided whether it was going to raise its millages.